What is going on everyone? My name is Eskimo and I've done this commentary about a hundred times now, but hopefully this is the time that I finally finish it because ugh, man, this has been weighing in on my shoulders for such a long time. It's such a heavy burden to bear, but about a year and a couple months ago I made a commentary telling you guys that my family was bankrupt and that eventually I'd have to quit YouTube. Well, my parents told me last March that they were bankrupt and that I'd have to quit YouTube, that we'd be moving somewhere else. And, uh, you know, uh, whenever your your family goes through bankruptcy, yeah, bankruptcy, I don't know if it's the same everywhere else, but where I live in the state of Indiana, they pretty much only give you a year and six months to move out of your current house or your current place of residence and find a new place to live. Well, my parents... Um, well, like I said, they told me in March of last year, 2012, so you can get an idea of how long it's been and that I don't have much time left. I, I, if anything, I have like a month or two left, which is, well, you know, you may have noticed it's been stressing me out the past two months, and I really haven't been the happy-go-lucky Eskimo I used to be. Um, I've been really infrequent with the uploads. You know, I may upload like five days in a row, then skip a day or upload for like three weeks and skip a week or however long I skip it, it's just I've been so infrequent with the uploads and I don't want to be you know I love doing YouTube and the only reason I've done YouTube for the past uh, year and however many months is because I love doing it you know obviously why would I do it if I didn't love it because back then whenever my parents told me I only had 300 subs so uh I wasn't getting anything out of YouTube, and even then, now, I'm not getting paid. I haven't gotten paid from YouTube in, like, a year anyways, but, uh, you know, I haven't gotten paid for YouTube. It's just, like, damn, like, what am I going to do? I seriously don't know what I'm going to do because I've been, I'm in such a such stressful situation. I'm sorry, right now, even now, I'm just on the verge of tears and, like, it's really hard for me to admit, but I've cried several times over this, and, you know, it's... I just don't know what I'm gonna gonna do is I've got my hands tied behind my back you know I'm just scratching my head so stressed out all the time because you know in like a month or two I'm gonna have to leave all my friends I'm gonna have to quit YouTube which I absolutely love doing you know if I had the opportunity to to continue YouTube and do it as a job I would but uh, <laughs> In the meantime, like, I would still continue my dreams, and, like, my dream is, like, whenever I turn 21, so I'm not old enough to become a police officer yet, but I want to become a police officer, I just spoiled it anyways, but, um, whenever I turn 21, I want to go to police af academy, become a police officer, and, um, you know, pretty much help people, because that's what I want to do with my life. Because, like, I've always been the person that talks to people and helps them out with their feelings and stuff like that. Like, I've always been such a caring guy and trying to help people out. And that's what I want to do with my life. I want to help people out. And, you know, to me, it was like, either I become a police officer, you know, or I could become a psychiatrist and go to school for, like, eight years. But, um, my family's obviously poor. I can't afford to become a psychiatrist. And besides a police officer, I could become, like, a, uh school teacher but a police officer definitely way, makes way more than a, a school teacher so that was pretty much uh, the thought process beside, uh, on becoming a police officer because I want to become a uh, I want to help people obviously and a police officer would allow me to do that but also it's definitely making more than a school teacher so yeah that's pretty much what I want to do with my life and like I said I'm not old enough to become a police officer yet I have to be 21 and right now I'm 20. Uh, my actual birthday is in September, and uh, I'll turn 21 then. But if you do the math in two months, which is September, I'll pretty much be kicked out of my house anyway. So maybe then I'll be able to I'll be able to go to police academy. It's just a matter of I have to be old enough to apply anyway. So I'll find out then if I'm accepted. But even then, a police academy is like a year-long thing. So. Even then, like, if I did go to police academy and it, it all worked out, I'd still have to get a job after that, and it would be, like, a year before I even, well, like a year before I even uh, could continue YouTube again because 
as it is right now, I can't continue YouTube. Like, my other options were to move out and move in with a friend. And one of my friends, like, I love him to death. He's been one of my best friends for such a long time, but he lives so far away. And I'd have to quit my current job. I'd have to get a new job. And the only place I could apply near where he lives is a bar. And then I'd have to be 21 because I live in America and the drinking age is 21. So I'm not even old enough to do that if I wanted to. Um, but, uh... The other option was with another friend, and he'd, you know, for like months and months and months, he was telling me, hey, man, we're going to do this, we're going to move out, and we're getting an apartment together. But pretty much the last minute, he bailed on me, and it's just like, wow, now I, now this ha is going to happen. Now I just don't know what to do. I'm going to have to quit YouTube. So hopefully you guys understand some of the stress I'm under. And, yeah, guys, I've been asking him, I love you all. I'll do YouTube in the meantime, but I'll quit eventually. Bye.